Shepard, what can I do for you? Have you got time to talk? I really need to clean up this engine. Maybe later. I'll let you work. Talk to you later. Alright, they've got nothing to say. Grunts won't have anything to say. Okay, I wanna just check my cabin. Where is that Shepard VI? Maybe we don't get it. I seem to vaguely remember getting the Shepard VI in the in the captain's cabin. But uh, apparently not. Unless he's here, or she is here in this case. No, 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 it's just armor. Ah, uh, this is so depressing, the fish. Uh, team status. What's your outfit? Ew, red. Alright, let's just keep that one. Um, Alright, don't really want to do anything else. So we've got Samara, Morden. Morden and Grunter on Tachanka. We can do those together. So it's Samara, then Miranda, and then we go to Tachanka. I think that sounds good to me. Uh, let me just check this again. See how how we're doing here. Oh look, three more, three more, and we're done. That that sounds good. After that, it's the insanity badge, which we're not going to do on video, of course. I have to play through the game again. This one, I've played through this game several times. I've never gotten this one. I'll, I'll try in this playthrough. Rescue Doctor Manikens and without attracting hostile attention. This game's not the best for stealth, but apparently you can do it. And this, I have no idea what this is about. But uh, uh, we all, we're close to getting all the achievements. Yay! Alright, so let's go back to Ilium and do Samara's mission. I believe we are leaving here. E yes, mass relay. Do I need... I do need this stuff. Yes, I do. And fuel. Yeah, I th actually, would I say Ilium or Omega? I keep saying the wrong thing. We're going to Omega to help Samara. Actually, we can recapture a freighter here too. Let me just do Samara's mission and then see how much time that takes. And then I might recapture a freighter or something around here. Alright, let's go to Omega. Alright. We have bought everything here, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we have. I can, I can check again. If you guys think that's a good idea. <laughs> yeah, let, let's double check the shelves. Alright, we're gonna bring Samara. What, what, and I'm gonna bring Morden. Okay, uh, sorry, just the car. What is this? Recharge time bonus, weapon damage bonus. I'm gonna do the re recharge time bonus. Because um, her biotics are pretty awesome. Do I want throw or pull? I think throw is more useful. It's direct damage, I think. What is this? Heavy throw or throw field? Let's do throw field because that sounds awesome. And then do that. Morden is fine. Maybe. Maybe she has. Alright, let's, let's go for another walk around. Omega. Samara might have some things to say too, because remember every time we go to one of these places, 
There's locations for people to say things. Kevin? Got something to report? There's an awful lot Fort of or a pestilence, nothing more. I'll just be going. Keep up the good. All right. Work. He has nothing new to say. Oh, there's side quests. Is that Shepherd? Yes. Greeting. I was hoping you'd come by. I'm Ish, and this is Cell. You look like a good person to know. Friendly faces seem hard to come by around here. Reasonable people are more valuable than air in a place like this. You need something? Well, if you'd be so kind, I hoped you might consider a proposition. I need skilled, trustworthy people to take care of a little business for me. Nothing illegal, of course, but it's paying work. What kind of business do you do? Important business. So important that, with your help, we can change Omega. What do you mean, we can change Omega? Well, I didn't want to say anything, but certain people here have business deals with people throughout the galaxy. If we were to have information involving those deals, we could make some ripples around here. That's all I'll say. You haven't actually said anything, bro. I'm listening. I'm in the information business. Specifically, the buying and selling of privileged material. It's nothing illicit. I just need someone to pick up packages in certain locations and bring them to me here. What's your angle? No angle. I'm a simple businessman. What do you say? Uh-huh. I can do that. My contacts use specific drop points. I need you to look outside Merib's shop on the Citadel and inside Eternity on Ilium. Look around for anything that might hold a data package and bring those packages to me. Good luck, my friends. I have to go to the Citadel and to Ilium. Ah. Well, let's, let's keep this stuff in mind. In fact, I've got a lot of other things in the journal that we haven't really done. <laughs> this guy. This guy. Alright, so the shops are around here. Also, look at that. Interesting view. Also note that the light is pointing right at us. Again, remember back on Ilium? You walk through the corridor and the sun's right in your face. Here, you walk through here, the light's right in your face. Just because of lens flares. They want those lens flares on screen. So they put that light right there. Look at that. Carrot Emporium. Oh, okay, I did have things I haven't bought yet. That's good. Maybe I should put that on. Because that's more ammo, right? Oh, look at this stuff. Is this stuff I I missed on missions? It might be. I'm sure I cleaned out these stores the last time I was here. Ah, here we go. People come to places such as this, seeking a better life. Give it all up and, and go into hiding here? in the abyss. Yes. Don't. Violent people forced into destitution on a world filled with criminals. They deserve protection. If I survive your mission, I may return here. I don't think Arya Tilok would be very happy about you being here, Samara. You know, I I, 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 I appreciate Justicars doing what they do, but not everyone's a victim. I don't know if he's a victim or if he's just drunk, right? I mean, some people choose this. Although I guess a lot of people don't, and they are victims. Okay, nothing at Ken's salvage. Uh, I think I should go the okay. I should go the other way. Yeah, so there's random side quest here as well, like like Ish and then what's his name. I feel like I really need to check Ilium and the Citadel. I don't know if I've missed any. I don't know if any are time sensitive, sensitive, and I've missed them already. It's really hard to tell. Man, this music. Serious business. And this dancing, look. They are serious, look at that. Somebody animated that. Like somebody at Bioware spent the time to animate that. Or maybe it's motion capture. Maybe they mocap that. I mean, that might be... that's pretty entertaining, right? 
Imagine being the guy who has to animate that. Welcome to Afterlife. How may I serve you? I'm good for now. Of course. Thank you for. I got a mate and a ship. I only it's probably mocap. It's probably motion capture because that's really difficult to animate that. Seriously, that? But this though. This has to be mocap. I mean, no one can animate that. No one has the ability to, to, to manually animate Shepard Dance. It has to be mocap. They must have spent like a week just mocapping that. Because it's, it's just so amazing, that Shepard Dance. Alright, so nothing's here. Let's talk to Arya to look. Uh, Helena Blake is still sitting around here, not doing much. Um, they're not recruiting mercs anymore. And there's no one up here. Alright, let's go talk to Arya. You wanna talk? Talk to Arya. Hey Arya. What do you need? An Asari fugitive is hiding out here. She's an Ardat Yakshi. We need to find her. I knew it. Nothing leaves a body quite so empty as an Ardat Yakshi does. You haven't taken steps to kill her. Why would I? She hasn't tried to seduce me. Her last victim was a young girl. Pretty thing. Lived in the tenements near here. That's where I start looking. Thanks for the help. Good luck finding her. Better luck catching her. <laughs> so Arya knows everything around here, which is pretty amazing. Nothing to see here. Like, how would you how would you keep up with everything that happens around here? Alright, so now we have to go all the way back to the apartments. Which is back where we came from. That guy still hasn't gotten in. <laughs> Alright, apartments are over here. We can't we can't even talk to the prophet, I'm kinda of disappointed about that. I want to talk to him about humans and materians. This is a terrible apartment. Look at this place. How do you how do you live here? Look at what are those things on the ground? Ew. Are you here about my daughter? My nephew died a week ago, and no one seems to care. The medic said it was a brain hemorrhage, but that's not true. It was murder. Someone killed my nephew, my baby. I think she was murdered too, and I'm looking for her killer. Oh, thank you. It's so hard when no one believes you. I'm all alone now. Are you one of Arya's people? No. I'm here to help. Does it matter who sent me? No one else on this hellhole station gives a damn that my nephew is dead. If you can do something about it, I'll help you however I can. Did your daughter have a lot of friends? Not a lot, no. She was shy. Spent most of her time off making her sculptures, not hanging out with friends. Something did change in the last few weeks, though. She started talking about an Asari. Mornth. I see. I didn't like her. She kept dragging Neff out to clubs, and I'm pretty sure she gave my daughter drugs. Uh-huh. What kind of a person was this Morinth? I never met her. But Neff talked about her like she was a queen. You'd swear there was no one else alive when she talked about Morinth. That sounds familiar. Samara, does Morinth control her victims with drugs? She controls them through sheer will. The drugs are just a lifestyle. She loves the club, loves the base. She's a hedonist. So this Morinth did hurt my daughter? Is she the one that... that... I will bring justice to the one that did this. We swear to you, Neff will rest easy soon. I hope so. I hope so. 
my baby. Did Neff hang out anywhere in particular? She was always quiet working here at home. Then, a few weeks ago, she started going out all the time to the VIP area of that club down the street. I think you need a password or something to get in there. The change was so sudden. She just seemed tired and distracted when she wasn't around Morin. What kind of a girl was your daughter? My nephew had a fire inside her. She was shy, but she was creative and driven and the best girl a mother could hope for. She was creative. How so? She was a sculptor. Several galleries were interested in her. Said her work was fresh. Do you mind if I examine Neff's room? I didn't want to disturb anything. Her clothes, her art, her sculptures, everything is the way she left it. The way it will always be. My baby is gone. Thank you. I'm sorry. I just miss her so much. It's okay. We've all suffered loss. I know what it means to lose a daughter. I will avenge her. Thank you. Please, if it helps you find her killer, look through her things. We will be respectful. I'll examine her things. Right.